I'm sorry Matthew that my poems bore you. I'll try my best to attempt to break through. There must be a way to reach you somehow, to get the young you with morals to come out. So often you're around on all of our pages, even if you're arguing, you're still engaging, boosting the videos to be seen by more, yet still stubbornly reluctant to really explore, still firmly in denial, saying that you'll never change. But so did every vegan once, they'll tell you the same. None of us really wanted to accept that we were wrong, or how we'd been sheltered or misinformed for so long. Everyone shows some resistance once upon a time, before they get it and their morals and actions align. Again, I think I speak for us all when I talk about regret. The only one we have is that it took us so long to connect. We have the why to turn our species and offer respect, others for who they are and not what we can get. It's not complicated really, a very simple philosophy. Just treat others how you want to be treated, consistently. If you wouldn't want it for you, don't demand it for them. Be congruous with your views and with your position. If you were in their place and this was happening to you, would you still uphold all the same selfish views? What would you think about being exploited and trapped, knowing that there are people out there laughing at that, disrespecting your existence and mocking it too? How would you feel about that then, Matthew? Would you still be as provocative in the face of oppression, or be as hopeless as those who you show no compassion? Let me tell you this though, so you can know it as truth. If it was yourself in this situation, I'd be fighting for you. Regardless of your ignorance, denial and insulting behaviour, it would be us, the vegans, shouting to fucking saviour. We wouldn't discriminate because of your petulance, recognising that you're capable of benevolence, and even if you weren't, you'd still have your rights. Not just your human ones, but the most basic in life. To have full autonomy with the freedom just to exist, free from being infringed except of consenting to this. Even if this was boring, I implore you please Matthew, think about it from the perspective of those victims of you.